some missions you uh, you know are very intense. They are you know seven days a week. Um, you know, years later in Afghanistan, I was on a routine in a coalition headquarters of you, seven days a week, but on Sunday you started two hours later, and that was the only rest cycle you would get. So very intense. Um, Rwanda, the the days were full, but the evenings, you know, short of finishing reports and things like that. There were there was an officers' mess in Kigali. There was a sergeant's mess in Kigali, and there was a soldiers' mess in Kigali. Uh, they would only open to serve alcohol maybe sort of two nights a week, a Friday, Saturday night type thing. But on the other nights, you could go there and there were, uh, you know, videotapes in those days available and you could watch videotapes or play board games or chess and those sorts of things. So we would do that or we would go and sit on the veranda or outside people's rooms and tell stories and sing songs and do that sort of stuff. It was pretty rudimentary but we also were able to do uh, both organised PT inside the barracks and in the early days um, of the mission too there were uh, other activities such as uh, runs that were organised through the city so you could go and do a longer, I think it was a five kilometre or a ten kilometre run that we did occasionally. Um, Also through the course of the mission uh, I organised a rugby game with the British parachute field ambulance that we trained up for for a couple of weeks and went and uh, got the engineers to uh, clear an oval of make sure there were no mines and other munitions on there and then we we staged the rugby game so there were some good activities in amongst all of the other stuff as well we had we share a national day with India and we were sharing the barracks in Kigali with uh, an Indian unit for many many months and so we had a combined national day with them where we did cultural events and played uh, a game of cricket as well, and those sorts of things. So there was, there was, there was the ability to get some respite 